The Chesapeake Ripper murders in Sounders of Three. A sounder refers to a small group of pigs, keep that in mind. He killed his first victims in the span of nine days, Annapolis, Essex, and Baltimore. He didn't kill again for 18 months. And then what's next? Three more wind up dead. His crimes are in people's heads, leave them drowning in dread. This time they're all in Baltimore, so he's settling a score. He treats his victims how he sees them, bunch of pigs in the pen. Not people, not prey, not even innocent men. Elegant with execution, makes death look renaissance. Everyone has thought about it, but no one knows a thing about it. The Chesapeake River walks free, about time he had another spree. The unfortunate eighth killed with every tool within reach. He's nailed to the pegboard, blood dripping beneath a cruel mockery. He must have been rude. His death display was crude. Take a second look. There's trophies that he took, a distinct brutality. When the Chesapeake Ripper rips, he shows no mercy. The removal of organs among abdominal mutilations. This had to have been done by someone with surgical or anatomical knowledge. Eleven months pass, ain't already dead. An FBI trainee, Miriam Lass, was investigating private medical records of all the known victims when she disappeared. She is believed to be the Ripper's ninth, but not a trace of her was found. Here we are today, wrapped up in his design, strung up in the Ripper's cobweb like flies, leaves us pieces of bait. We're a school of fish and he's got a speared. You should be scared. Just recently, news discovered Freddy Lowndes on the scene, a sight to behold so obscene. Miriam Lass was no longer six feet under. Two years later, her severed arm was discovered, but only because he wanted it to be. It's a part of his show, we're sitting in the front row. He decorates the theater. Carnage strewn across the stage, his composing hands turn the page. This is it, he performs again. Sound off now, he'll kill with grace, without a face, give us a show. The nature of his crimes hidden between the lines, invisible to the naked eye. Everyone has thought about it, but no one knows a thing about it. The Chesapeake River was free, about time he had another spree. This is his design, 